thought that I would start off this vlog by sitting down and telling you why my moving vlog was so little and I hardly filmed anything. Basically, halfway through moving day, I received a call and something in my personal life happened that is fairly serious. And I had to spend the rest of the day doing errands, running around town, calling people, going and talking to people. And I pretty much spent all day after work yesterday doing that as well. And it kind of just felt wrong to like put on a happy face for the camera and pretend that moving was going fine because moving was going fine, but I was was freaking out and I had so much to do and so much going on and I can't really talk about it online because it is quite personal and really quite scary actually but you guys are my friends and I just, just want to apologize for my moving vlog but it is Thursday today and we moved in on Tuesday so this is our second day in the new house and honestly so far I'm really loving it Rachel and I have both said that since putting our furniture in this house and moving in and slowly getting situated here we're liking this house more and more and it's not that we didn't like it when we applied and got approved we just weren't really that excited about it and not excited about moving because you guys know our old house was so cute this house just doesn't have as much character as the last one but we're really really enjoying this house so far it is still quite a mess because we haven't put everything away I start work at 2 today and I'm working till 9 30 but I'm kind of waiting on a serious phone call this morning so hopefully I get that and that doesn't really interfere with my day but I think this morning I just want to get some computer work done I have a bunch of emails to do and lots of editing to do but I am I'm drinking my coffee now i'm gonna drink this just chill out for two seconds and then i'm gonna make some breakfast and get into all of my work for today thanks for listening to me ramble <laughs> i'll chat to you soon Good morning friends, it is now Friday and I never ended up updating you after yesterday but I just went to work for the rest of the night then came home and went to sleep. But it is now Friday and I'm just at the old place currently. Um, I just came because I had to pick up one last set of keys and I need to drop off an internet modem for the owners who are moving in so that they can have NBN because we paid $200 for a technician to come and get internet at this place. But I just did a walk through looking at like how well it was cleaned from the bond cleaners and stuff. Obviously I hand the keys back today so there's not much I could do but it's so crazy seeing this place empty like this is what it looked like six months ago when we moved in and i just think that's so insane this was our office and it's all completely empty the kitchen my dogs are squeaking very loudly <laughs> got the bathroom which is so clean looks so good seeing a place that used to have all of your stuff in it now empty is so weird and my camera is not focusing i guess there's nothing to focus on but this is my room like i honestly just want to cry and i don't know why it's just like sad seeing like this chapter of our lives officially closed i guess fingers crossed everything goes well when i hand the keys back i'm gonna get the modem plug it in and then i'm gonna head to the real estate office and hand in our keys and happy saturday this is finally the weekend and i'm so happy about it <laughs> i've had a really chill and relaxed morning i ended up going to bed really really late last night no real reason in particular i went to bed at 1am which is pretty much unheard of for me and so i think i got out of bed at like 8am this morning which is such a big sleep in but obviously i needed it because i didn't go to bed at my normal 9pm time but i woke up i had a shower i made my breakfast i had my quiet time which was really good and i have just been doing a bunch of paperwork and organizing things so I think I'm gonna put an actual outfit on and I need to go to my parents house to do something for my brother I need to go to the post office to do something I think I might just get a coffee while I'm out because I feel like it and it's the weekend Rachel's out at the moment but I think when she comes home we're gonna like do some work together in the office and then tonight we have our friend Anita's 21st birthday which is really fun and exciting and I feel like I haven't done anything fun this week or even the past two weeks so I'm really excited to go and see a bunch of my old school friends and celebrate her so that'll be fun but for now, I'm gonna go get dressed, get ready. Uh, my favorite t-shirt at the moment. This is from Princess Polly. I got heaps of questions in my last video about it. Here is my code if you wanna use it. 
So just a bit of an update for you. I went to my parents' house to do something for my little brother and I got there and I texted him about it and he said I didn't have to do it anymore. So that's great. I then just went to the post office and I was just Googling what I had to do before I went in there and then I realized that I could just do it online. So I sat in my car and I did it online. Now I don't really know what to do. I guess I'll go get my coffee. What a flop. I'm such a mess. It has been so long since I talked to you but honestly haven't missed much. I just sat around at home in the office getting heaps of work done but Rachel and I have just gotten ready because we have Saturday night plans. Are you shocked? Because I am. We're going out to our friend Anita's place and we're celebrating her 21st birthday tonight, which is so fun and so exciting. I think there's going to be a few people there that we haven't seen in ages. Skay and Easy are going from the OG squad house. So Rachel and I have just gotten ready. We're going to go get some Taco Bell for dinner and then head over to the party. I'll show you my outfit quickly. Rachel's hiding all the mess that's on my bed for you. I'm wearing this cute little dress from Micah and Muse. I think it's so, so cute. My first time wearing it as well. And then I've just paired it with all white bands a platform which I think make them a little bit more fun. <laughs> Let's go get Taco Bell! Hello! Long time no see! Welcome, welcome, welcome back! We're just at Anita's house, just chilling out. Everyone's at the photo booth, so I'm vlogging while no one is here. <laughs> that is stressful! Do you have anything to update subscribers on the podcast? Um, it's like worked a year ago. You're about to move oh, house? I'm it on Thursday. So the end of next week, every single member from the squad house will be in a new house. Like as since in when we moved out. House. Yeah. We all moved into one house when we moved out, and now we're all moved yeah. again. So this yeah. is the last second house. How fun! Love we moving. love moving. Just love, love it. it. Love buying couches and fridges. Home. Hello, hello. Do you have anything to update everyone? Easy also moved and graduated and still unemployed. Woohoo! <laughs> that for us. You spilled your drink on me. Sorry. My water. <laughs> Wipe that one away. I've just hopped into bed after the party tonight. I had so much fun. It just felt like such an OG high school house party and I had so much fun. It was so good to see Izzy, Skay and Anita. Honestly, those girls just feel like family and every time I see them, I just leave feeling so happy and so blessed. But Rachel and I came home and watched some Netflix and now it's like 11 p.m. So we are exhausted and we are gonna go to bed. <laughs> hey Siri, good night. The scene is set, good night. Good morning friends, it is now Sunday and I had the biggest sleep in and I feel like I've said that every single day this week but next week I am like definitely getting back into routine I'm waking up at 6am every day I'm going to film a whole video on like getting back on track which I'm like kind of excited about but also like kind of dreading it because I don't want to get back on track like I don't want to get back into my productive routine but I obviously have to so today was kind of the last day that I could like sleep in and like enjoy my time in my new bed normally by 8am the sun is like blinding me in here that I have to get out of bed but today it's super gloomy so I just stayed in bed for a little while longer. I watched some YouTube videos. It is now 10.30. That's awful. I'm going to quickly just wash my face, put some makeup on, and maybe do my hair a little bit. And I've decided that I'm going to go shopping this morning because I feel like it. definitely need to clean this mirror so please ignore that but I've just gotten it ready for the day this is my outfit my jeans are from cotton on my t-shirt and my little handbag are both from princess Polly and I just have my black checkered slip on vans I've got my coffee I'm ready to do some shopping Quite a lot later now we ended up coming home from our shopping trip and pretty much heading straight to Bible study and then straight to church so had a very busy afternoon but had a really good time we just got home from church and it's 9 p.m. and I have a very big week ahead of me so I just want to start it off with a really good night's rest so I'm gonna end off this vlog here if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already I know that this was such a weird random vlog where I was really vague and I'm just in a very weird like headspace transitional time but I hope that you enjoyed this vlog nonetheless and I'll catch you in my next one in the very near future. Bye!